Welcome to Sylvia Stingray. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sylvia, your Yuri Manwa Translator. Hey guys, good morning. Let me present you the new chapter of There are always teacher asking for parents. Drinking really made things worse. Someone tricked me. And I even took the initiative to get in. See Yan, right now, she seems to be happy. Go ahead, I'll wait for you. Well, about what happened yesterday. Now, Lu Xiao want to talk about it. See Yan, she was really happy. Especially, she stayed whole night. Wow, did I really go back to see Yan's house because I didn't want Yu Yu to worry? Lu Xiao, right now, she was confused. Well, she remembers what happened. Now, she was hesitating to go back on Sian's house or something else. Now, she went to the bathroom just to fix herself and tidy up since she already awake now. Sian, she is wiping her face. Now, she looks really worried. Although Sian, she was really happy seeing Lu Xiao on her side. For Lu Xiao, of course, she was really shy. Sian always helped her. Sian asks her, have you washed up? It's time to start breakfast. Now, Lu Xiao answered her and said, good. Well, it seems that Lu Xiao is not shy anymore. When she came back to Sian, Sian prepared it. Lunch box for New News breakfast. Sian said to her, give it to New New later. Now, the two of them finally going to eat breakfast. But suddenly, to see and surprise, she shall move closer to her. She kiss her on the cheek. Keeping like this. Now, Sian, she was really surprised by the actions of Lu Xiao. Sian, look at her. Now, she really can't speak. She was looking on Sian. Probably, Sian, it's a thank you for always taking care of her. Now, the two of them. Suddenly get shy. I will go home and see Niu Niu. She shall said to Sian. Now Sian, she turned back. Now she was really shy. Well, these two girls, they're really cute. They're teasing each other. Right now, they're shy to face each other. She shall, she was too shy. That's why right now, that's why right now she was rushing to go to the door. Sian was calling her. Bring Yunyu over to have breakfast so you don't have to cook it for yourself. Ask Teacher C to treat her to the food. Now, Teacher C, she really gets serious. Now, she wants Yunyu to come over and also take a breakfast with them. So she shall set um. Finally, she's not shy anymore. But still, she will go home and check Yunyu if everything is okay. Well, leaving Sian alone. Now, look at her. She looks really calm. Although the sudden kiss has really made her high. Now, it's like she was on the clouds. Now, she is touching her cheeks. And look at it. This is the day she's been waiting for. One day, Lu Xiao will kiss her without any restraint comes from her. Lu Xiao. She was really in a good mood. Right now, looking at Sian, she was really happy and it's like she was on a daydream. She said to herself, hey, hey, hey. Now, Lu Xiao, she went to Nyu Nyu's room. She was checking. Nyu Nyu is already awake. But when she went in, Nyu Nyu was still sleeping soundly. Now, it really makes her worry. For Nyu Nyu. She will wake up early. Right now, soft voice, she was calling Nyu Nyu. Get up and have a breakfast with me. Still Nyu Nyu. She was still asleep. She is not moving. She is motionless. Seems like Nyu Nyu. She got to bed late at night. That's why until now, she is not awake. Even though the time is 8 o'clock in the morning. Now, it's make Lu Xiao to get worried. Junior's living habits have always been very good. 
always goes to bed early and get up early. Now it's past 8 o'clock. She's still sleeping deeply. Now it's make low she shall to really get for it. Maybe the child, she really gets scared last night. Lu Xiao caressing the face of Lu Wei and said to herself, forget it, let's her sleep a little longer. Now she's decided that she will let Lu Wei to sleep more. And now she returned back to Sion's house to eat breakfast. The two of them are facing each other and slowly eating breakfast. Sion was great to pack a breakfast for Nyu Nyu. Now it was on a lunchbox. She shall want to explain to Sian. Yesterday, what a coincidence, you are there too. Now, oh, she looks agitated. Well, for Sian, of course, it was really lucky. Last night, she was in the same place, went out on Christmas Eve and just about to drive home. I saw you. Now, oh, she falls. Sian, she looks pretty serious. Now, she is holding a dumpling. Place it. To Lucy Shaw's plate. Come on, here's the fry the dumplings. Now, Lucy Shaw, she was surprised. Two of them are seriously talking. Suddenly, Sian, she got interrupted. Lucy Shaw Lucy Shaw said to her, Did you play alone? No, I'm with my friends. Sian said to her, Now, Sian, she's still happy. Well, this girl didn't even know. Right now, Lucy Shaw seems that she was really get jealous. She is wondering who is the friends Sian's talking about. Well, for Sian, she is with the girlfriends. Now, looking at it, Sian said to her, Have girlfriends already. Now, it makes sense. Lucy Shaw is really getting jealous. Now, hearing this, it can make her to calm down. Oh, he has a girlfriend. What about those before? Oh, Lucy Shaw. She really get for it. Well, she was thinking, Sian, is she really have a girlfriend? Now she thinks the kisses, the hugs, and the words I said. Now it makes sense. She was really getting jealous. Well, let's hope. It's only a misunderstanding. And Lucy Shaw, she won't misunderstand. But Sian, she has only have a girlfriend, not a girlfriend in the relationship. Now she is shaking her head. What were those things before? Now looking at her, she looks really sad. Now suddenly Sian interrupted her. The meaning of female friends. Oh, it turns out it was a friend, not a girlfriend. Now Sian is wiping her face. To assure her she don't have any girlfriend hey guys thank you for watching if you like the video please don't forget to like share and subscribe bye